Well, you can use Gemini's AI to generate a great looking design for your professional business card. So this is just one example that I created with the model in Gemini. And by the way, later I'll show you how you can turn that design into a mockup using the same AI image too. So uh, this is very useful if you want to visualize the content or the design before you finalizing it into a real product. So uh, this is one example. This is of course not a real business card. And I'll also, the prompt that I'm about to show in this video will work on any logo or any organization. You can upload your own logo alongside with providing information like your name, position, social media, contact, email, etc. And AI will actually design the card based on your industry. So the process is basically automatic. You don't have to deal with it prompting too much because the prompt is quite versatile. Now, let me show you how you can uh, create fantastic looking business card using Gemini AI. First, let's navigate to gemini.google.com. And for this demonstration, I will use this logo. I don't know what is this logo from. I don't know what is the organization. I think this is just an example of a logo, uh, just some random logo that I found on the internet. So I'll just use it. And after that, I'm going to paste or upload the logo into Gemini. Now, this is the prompt that you can insert. I know it is very long, but uh, don't worry. I'm going to put the full prompt in the description or perhaps the comment down below. And there is one thing here that you need to provide, which is at the end of the prompt. And that is your information, like your name, position, your uh, phone number, email, social media, etc. This is one example that I'm going to use. So it's at the end of the prompt. And I use the name, position, organization, industry, phone, email, and Instagram. I think I want to talk a bit more about social media here because uh, the prompt is actually trying to create an icon based on the Instagram, sorry, based on the social media platform that you are providing in the details. So it could be Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, or X, threads, etc. So you have to name the platform clearly in your detail it's very very important now after that you can click tools click create images and just send the message so again this prompt will look into the logo will analyze the color the shape etc and will apply that into the design of the car it is actually pretty cool uh seeing it is able to convert the design into a business car i think that's pretty cool so we got uh, this result as you can see I would say that's pretty uh, pretty relevant to the design of the logo, like there is some curvy lines and it is the, the element that is being utilized into the car. I think it looks pretty cool. Now, we are basically done and I think you can maybe use it for your business car or perhaps you can send it to someone to make it uh, prettier or clean up some um, messy details in the picture. But overall, I would say it looks great. Now let's turn this design into some mock-up photos and this is the prompt that you can use i'm going to just copy it and again the full prompt is going to be available in the description down below and this time around you can actually modify the prompt so the prompt here is trying to force gemini to generate five pictures or five mockups in one response and there is image one there's also image two image three etc you can modify it but this is just one example that i use for my video now just send a message and wait for gemini to create up to five pictures not one five it is actually possible to create multiple images you just need to specify that you want to create uh, five six seven images in one response it is something that you can do and it is very useful to save your time now how we got at this result as you can see it is able to follow the color the overall design and yeah that's why i said this prompt is quite versatile you can use it in many many situations in many logos yeah i think it looks great and Maybe you can use it on your real business card design. So that's basically how you can generate a great looking uh, business card using Gemini alongside creating some realistic mockups based on the design. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. I wish you a great day ahead.